the best chess challenge of all time, starting now. Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Nitzan Steinberg, I'm chess grandmaster and I'm playing chess for 22 years. Today we will mark the start of an epic challenge series and we're kicking things off with something absolutely wild. I'm going head to head against a chess comp computer rated 400 but here is the twist, I'm playing blindfolded. Well, not literally, but every piece on the board will completely invisible. That means I will have to visualize the entire game and still try to outsmart the computer. This is just the first of many intense challenges. Next up, I will face a computer rated 800, then 1200, and the levels will keep getting higher. Think you got what it takes? Watch me take on the first challenge and then I dare you to try to do it. So let the challenge begin. You know, I'm just in the Chesscom website. I click to play and play against bots. And you can see here Coach Danny and we will play against him. So how can we put the pieces blindfolded? So as you can see, I'm just clicking the settings here and now on the pieces for now it's classic and I will check and just choose blindfold as you probably can see, right? So I will click here and blindfold and let's do it save and now as you can see the board is just without pieces. So let's play against Coach Danny, 400 rating, but I am without the pieces. I'm just playing blindfold. So let's do it. Come on. So I'm playing e4, d5. He takes d5. He's playing the Scandinavian. Okay, I will play knight c3. Now I'm attacking the queen. Queen e5 check. I will play the move knight from g to e2. He played queen a5. Okay. I will play the move d4, just developing our pawn and also opening my bishop. Knight f6 he played, okay. And maybe I will play g3, I think about g3 or maybe bishop f4. Hmm, interesting. I think I will play the move g3. Queen to b6. Now let's see that uh, he's not threatening every nothing, just right nothing. I will play bishop g2, develop my bishop. And now e5 he play. As I can see in my head, I just can take it. So d takes e5. He play knight g4. Now it's he has two threats. Queen takes f2, check, and also knight takes e5. So I will do a short castle. Knight takes e5. I will play knight d5. Queen c5, okay. And let's play the move bishop to f4. Knight f3, I just take, take it, thank you. What he played? King to d8. What is this move? It's very bad move. I will play knight to c7 check. Bishop d7, I take the rook on a8. Knight c6, okay. I will play knight to c3. Bishop e7, okay. Let's bring back the knight, right? It looks fine overall, but maybe also knight d5. Let's play knight d5. Bishop f5. I think I will take it. Or maybe something else. Yeah, I will take it. We check. King takes. Rook e1 check. Bishop e6. Now I will bring the knight to c7. Rook to f8, okay. Maybe I missed something, but let's play queen. Hmm. 
Hmm, interesting. Let's play queen d3. A6. Let's bring the other rook to d1. B5. Now bishop d6, right? King d7. I'm just taking the queen. Now playing queen d6. Queen takes c6. And queen b7. Checkmate on the board. I beat Danny. The coach Danny. Blindfolded. So, ladies and gentlemen, I really hope you saw something here because I will put for you there something very, very nice that you will have the possibility to look on the board while I can't do it. So I won against Coach Danny without see the position, without see the pieces. I just saw it in my head, right? So I'm challenging you to do it and now I will do something interesting. I will put like settings and now classic. And now I really want to see how this game went. So e4, d5, let's understand what is going on, right? d5, e takes d5, queen takes, this is the Scandinavian. And let's click on the analyze. Okay, great. e4, d5, e takes d5, queen takes, knight c3. I'm attacking the queen, of course. Queen to e5 check, it's one move here. If I'm playing the move bishop e2, maybe he can play the move bishop g4 and I, I don't know, it also looks really good. d4, bishop takes, knight takes, it's fine for, for white of course. Queen a5 and we already, you know, developed two uh, pieces and pawn on d4, just castling, bishop f4 and everything is under control. But I play the move knight g2. Queen a5, here it's a little bit, uh, I think, mistake because you can just play the move knight f6 or maybe c6, something around, you know, like to develop your pieces. But after queen a5, I play the move d4. He played knight f6, now g3, just bringing another piece into the game. I want to develop my bishop in this diagonal. He played queen b6, bishop g2. e5, very bad move, just take the pawn, knight g4, and now don't forget about the threat on f2. So I just castle it, knight takes e5, knight d5. I'm attacking the queen on b6, and also the pawn on c7 is under attack. So queen c5, you know is going for it bishop f4 i'm developing another bishop as you can see i'm playing with all my pieces and now we play knight f3 just bringing me a full knight thank you very much computer so bishop takes f3 king d8 another very bad move just knight takes c7 i take the rook and now just developing a pieces knight c3 knight d5 takes rookie one check right bishop e6 now bring the other knight into the game Queen d3, I want to bring another rook into the game, so b5, just taking the queen, right? Queen d6 check, queen takes e6, and queen b7, checkmate on the board. So, really, hope that you like this video. Subscribe my channel, and this challenge, you must tell me how it goes for you. So, take it easy, but I believe in you, you can win Danny Coach. B bought and uh, 400 rating you know it's something difficult but it's really possible for you so write in the comment if you succeeded and also send this video to all of your chess friends the family that you really you know uh, likes to play chess and tell me if you succeeded this challenge and wait for the next challenge see you soon in the next challenge bye bye